Welcome to Save with Judy. I appreciate you guys being here so much. I wanted to share with you today a few new things that I have set, have made and put up on Etsy. I'm so used to saying the word save, I almost said saved on Etsy. But anyway, uh, I just wanted to share with you, uh, rather than put in a community post, I just thought I'd share with you what I put on. So uh, we will get started and I'll show you a few things and I hope that you like them. Okay, the first thing is this this is for summer and it's called beach time and it comes with two dashboards one for an a5 and one for the a6 and i'd love to be right there in one of those chairs right now okay and then it comes with six scratch cards and the whole total of all the cards is two hundred dollars so you have a two hundred dollar savings this one has the seagull and this one is a pretty woman on the beach. I hope these aren't, the glare is not too bad. And this one is the starfish. And this one is the beach bag with the hat. And this is another pretty woman on the beach. And then right there is where I'd like to be, sitting in that chair under that beach umbrella. <laughs> but anyway, these, like I said, it's a $200 savings. And... Uh, it works just like the wild mushrooms you see me play, and uh, I hope that you like it. Anyway, that's up on Etsy now. Everything I'm showing you is, is up and active on Etsy as of last night and this morning. <clears throat> okay, then we have this one. It's the Coffee Loving Gnomes, and I think they are so cute. It has all these little gnomes that drinking coffee or making coffee or sitting in the coffee beans or something. And it also comes with the A5 dashboard and the A6. And then it comes with 20 of these little scratch cards. And each one is different. And uh, it's, they're all little gnomes drinking coffee or something to do with coffee. That one says Cappuccino Lover. And that one says Cappuccino Lover too, but they're different. And... Uh, so anyway, I just think that they're so cute. There's one brewing his coffee. And uh, they amount to $100 in savings. And what's good about these little cards and some others that I have on there too, you can always use them over. When you scratch it off, you can put more scratchers on it and use it again as scratch. Or you could keep them and use them as randomizer cards. Just turn them upside down. On the back of this one is coffee beans. Just turn them upside down. Roll your dice to see which... Uh, envelope you want to stuff and draw a card and whatever amount is on that card so they kind of serve two purposes you can use them as your scratch cards first and when you get finished then start using them as a randomizer which you could do that with any of my little cards like this I have in my in my Etsy shop and it also comes with a little bag for you to keep them in them back in here Okay, and then I love the little coffee gnomes so much, and these are different. These that I'm getting ready to show you are not in the little card set, and this one I just called it Coffee Time, and this one is a $50 savings challenge. I just love his little feet, and this one is a $100 challenge. He's just relaxing with this coffee, and then this one is a $75 challenge. And this one is a 50. So you have two 50s, a 75, and a 100. And they're called Coffee Time. Okay. Now, to start in the fall, we have these. They're called Pumpkin Fairy Homes. And uh, they are so cute. They both come with... Uh, the A5 and A6 uh, dashboards also, and this one is also a $200 savings. And it is the six card set of scratchers, and each pumpkin home is different. I just think this is will be a nice uh, fall challenge to do. You could start it, say, mid-August and all the way up through October if you wanted to. 
So we have that one. It got put up on my it's in my Etsy shop today. Okay, then for Halloween, so far, I hope to have more Halloween stuff, but so far we have four scratchers made for Halloween. This is a hundred dollar savings challenge, and it is Jack-o-lantern. And then we have this one. It's a $50 challenge, and it's called Spooky Mansion. And this one is Happy Halloween. It's a $50 challenge. And then we have Good Witch, which is a $75 challenge. I bet all witches wish they were as pretty as her, don't you think? <laughs> so anyway, I have gone ahead and put these up on my, challenge, up on my Etsy shop in case people are starting to put their fall... Uh, binders together. Maybe you're not wanting to start your fall challenges right now, but wanting to get your binder ready. So I put those up. And then for Christmas, I put these on there. That's called gingerbread, gingerbread Winter. And these are gingerbread houses. This one is a $75 challenge. This one is a $50 challenge. This one is a $100 challenge, and this one is a $50 challenge. So they are also up. They went up just a while ago. And again, you know, a lot of people have started their Christmas challenges. I have. I've started my Christmas binder now. And so uh, when I get one finished, I might move one of these in there. And we have one more Christmas challenge. And it is another card set, and it is so cute. It's called Gingerbread Village. And it also comes with an, an A5 and A6 dashboard. It's a $100 savings. And then this is the cards for it. Let's get them all out. It has gingerbread houses, and no two are alike. They're all different. And there's 20 cards, and they add up to $100, and they have the red scratchers on them. And again, you can use them again as scratchers once you scratch them off, or you could use them as a randomizer. Use them as for as a randomizer for your Christmas binder. That would be a good idea. I might do that. So anyway, these are have also gone up in my Etsy shop. I know people think it's Christmas. You're already putting Christmas up, but a lot of people are doing their Christmas, putting money into Christmas savings challenges. So let's get some challenges out there for them. I know I am. So anyway, that's all we have right now. I do have the new uh, uh, the new gnomes for the uh, Sunday Playing with Friends Challenge, and I will be putting that up this week's, this probably maybe Sunday actually, so that people can start downloading it, so that they could have it ready for the first part of July. And uh, it's kind of the same challenge. I'm keeping the same color scheme and everything. I'm just changing the gnomes up, giving us some new gnomes to color. Only I'm putting gnomes on there that are in line with the months, July, August, and September. And I'm going to do the same thing. In January, we will change it up and do something completely different than the gnomes. But from now till the end of the year, we're going to do gnomes, but we're just going to change the gnomes up. And I'm also, I've also started working on your on a new challenge for 2025, a year challenge. So I know that so many of you have enjoyed my $300, uh, $5 a week challenge. So I'm going to be doing something similar to that. I know I've enjoyed doing it. And uh, I think we're like $120 or $25 in. So that's good. That's a great savings. So anyway, I just wanted to share that stuff with you. And I will be seeing you tomorrow for our regular uh, Thursday video. So until then, remember, I love you.